You still here? Yes. You're glad you came. Yes. Now, what do I mean by heritage? Well, the Random House Dictionary of the English Language gives us these as the first two definitions of heritage. First of all, that which comes or belongs to one by reason of birth. That which comes to or belongs to one by reason of birth. And certainly when we're talking about the new birth, we bring a heritage. There is something which comes to us by reason of that birth, right? But the second one is probably more to the point in, in this particular application. It's something reserved for one. A heritage is something which has been set aside for you. And we are moving forward, stepping together into... Uh, or beyond this anniversary, not erasing what's behind and not memorializing what's behind, but carrying what God has built into us forward for what's ahead. Amen. We have something which has been given to us, something which is reserved for us. In that period, we carry a heritage from where we've been. Now, a lot of you haven't been here that whole time. But there have been people here who have been faithful, who have served the Lord, who have worked to carry out the ministry that he's given them, who have found various ways to support the vision that we've been given together and have participated in that vision. And now the baton has been handed to us and we get to carry the next leg of the run. You say, how many laps are there in this race? I don't know, but we pass the baton every so often and we keep running. You say, who's going to run the anchor lap? I'm not sure. We may be the anchor lap. Who knows? But uh, one of us is going to run the last lap. One of us is going to run the last lap. But in the meantime, we've got to run every lap like it's the last lap. And like this is our last opportunity to succeed, right? 